Hey there YouTubers, this is Aaron with a final update on the Lynx Raspberry Pi version 2 build project and here this thing is pretty much in its completed state. I'm going to uh, have to put the final screws in it and put the button pads, or not the button pads, the hand grips back on the back, but other than that it is pretty much done. So I'm just going to go through a quick demo of everything and uh, enjoy here. So. We have the original power LED working, a 3.5 inch composite TFT LCD screen, all the original buttons hooked up, an upgraded 40 millimeter polycone speaker. You can't see any of those differences. On the back or the top side, we have the original audio controls. The shell isn't quite closed right now because I wanted to crack it open to show you the insides. The Comlinx port, the volume knobs, the uh, micro USB. Um, power charging port and a power on off switch in the brightness selection area there. On the very back side we have a SD card or micro SD card reader port installed and I have the insides kind of open up here you can see some of the uh, epoxy putty standoffs and things that I had to make to secure everything but uh, the open space gives the uh, Pi some ventilation as well but that's easy access to the card for changing. Got the original belt straps there and everything. And of course onto this back side, we have the, or, or bottom side, I have the factory battery cover, which will pull off and look at here, we have the bottom panel with all of the uh, ports. The bottom ports are the Raspberry Pi's power, AV out, and HDMI. And the top is a row of three USB ports. Those are actually, it's a small USB hub that's plugged in. And that is a piece of like 0 .060 acrylic plastic that's been laser cut by a friend. Thank you so much. It's turned out so awesome. We even laser etched in the, uh, the words and put some white paint in there. So that really sets it off. It's such a nice uh, touch on this project. So we crack into this thing here. And we have to be very careful to unplug some stuff because it's running. Undo the speaker jack, which their speaker port there. This is the original speaker is uh, speaker points there. But the, here's the, uh, the crazy internals of this thing, which we have uh, a breakaway connector for our LCD. A, uh, like I said, the upgraded speaker here. This is the original flex circuit, the original flex circuit connector. This is wired straight on into the GPIO pins on the Pi and they serve as all the buttons. We have the uh, relocated custom micro SD card reader that I had to build for this with just this wiring. Um, we have that little USB hub which is right here on top. It's kind of sandwiched in there and hot glued the heck out of that to hold that back panel in. Over here we have a USB sound card and up here we have a PAM 8403 power amplifier module. What happens is the USB sound card sends all the audio into the volume potentiometer and then to the headphone jack. And so when you're listening to the headphones, you're getting straight audio off of this and you can control the volume. And then when you plug in the headphone jack, it interrupts the circuit and then sends audio out to this. Just It combines the signal and sends a mono amp into the uh, amp and then that amplifies out to this, this speaker connector. So we get a 3 watt amp powering that speaker so it's nice and loud. We have the, that is very bright, the uh, Adafruit PowerBoost 1000C charge booster circuit, and that's the heart of the power distribution here. And we've got some pretty thick power wires going to the Pi and to the audio amp. And that all ties in just to a basic on off switch. And then we have a, uh, like a double cell 4400 milliamp. Uh, lithium ion battery that's got super velcro in place so it's easily removable if you need but overall it turned out really really well um, it works fantastic and I'm just I'm very pleased with this project so I hope you guys enjoy and uh, this Lynx was completely dead before we uh, went ahead and did it so that's kind of the disclaimer we didn't sacrifice a working Lynx to uh, build this project but we gave it new life and I I think uh, its new owner is going to be very happy. All right. Well, thanks for watching.